Sewers and welcome to Fashion Sewing Blog TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to serge chiffon and slippery fabrics. The first thing to do is to set your serger up with the correct thread, 100% polyester. Make sure you're using the correct size needle, which should be a fine needle, a size 10 or 70 or lower. Before taking your work to the serger, the best method of securing your fabric layers together is to use a basting stitch. The reason why, this will stop movement of your fabric rather than just using pins. Most modern searchers have a differential feed and what this means is that you can set the tension to deal with the different weights of your fabric so make sure you have the correct setting and always do it a tester. Always check your tension of your threads, again always do a tester. If you're still having problems sewing your slippery or chiffon type fabrics here's a little trick. Get a piece of tissue paper, a strip of tissue paper, place your fabric on top and then take it to your serger, lift the foot and you're going to stitch through all thicknesses. I'm away from my serger now and this is the end result. I've got the tissue paper on the back and I'll show you how it looks on the other side. The next thing to do is then to make sure you hold the stitching and tear away the tissue paper. And the end result is that you'll have a nicely sewn or serge seam that has no fluting or pluckering. So there we go, when you are serging chiffon or slippery type fabrics, those are the tips to remember. If you're still experiencing fluting or pluckering in your seams, then do try the trick with the, with the tissue paper. Don't forget to subscribe to Fashion Sewing Blog TV for free weekly video tutorials. And if you have any comments or queries, please put me in the comment box below and I will see you next time.